All right, <clears throat> so this is clearing practice. So this is the two, three clear, because as you can see, we have two down low and three across the chain line. At practice, we're gonna go ahead and use the red line. I believe it's the woman's uh, line that we can use so we don't have to use the full field. But the key to this is we are going to send this D guy, because all of our D poles can handle the ball over or actually, we're going to do this right here because if the goalie has the ball and they're not attacking him, that we can have this D guy come out like, like this and over, and the goalie can throw him the ball. And if that A2 goes here, then we still have four on side. And then as he comes back, we can catch that attackman offside. This D guy can go over, and we can throw that ball over to here, although that's kind of a rough throw. Uh, the other thing we can do is we can run the hook play where this midi, this could also be a deep hole as well, could run off the field and we have another midi coming on. Oops, I forgot to put that guy over here. So he comes off and he steps on and that's a very easy throw for that person to do. But in this play right here, as he comes back, we can also send this D guy over, especially if that attackman goes to here. We would all come back on side, the fox, and then we would throw that pass to here. Or actually, we'd attack it two on one. And if not, he could curl around. So if that attackman goes here, and then he would curl back around and that D guy would carry the ball over. And then for the sake of the practice, we can then come down and however many guys we have left over, we can play it out to the goal that we have back by the soccer goal and play that out um, as a fast break. 